This video will explain quantitation methods for nucleic acids and proteins using both fluorescence and UV visible absorbance. Thermo Fisher Scientific offers fluorescence and absorbance-based detection devices for fast, easy, and accurate quantitation of DNA, RNA, and protein. Both instruments require small sample volumes, normally one microliter. The Qubit 3 fluorometer is designed for quantitation of dilute or precious samples that are used in applications, including next-generation sequencing, genotyping, RNA analysis, and quantitative RT-PCR. The qubit fluorometer uses dyes selective for the biomolecule of interest. These dyes fluoresce when bound to the target biomolecule. The system does not detect other molecules that may be present in the sample. In this example, we show a double-stranded DNA assay. Additionally, the qubit RNA assay kits offer easy and accurate RNA quantification. These assays are highly selective for RNA over double-stranded DNA and are tolerant to common contaminants, such as salts, free nucleotides, solvents, detergents, or protein. The algorithms employed by the qubit fluorometer yields accurate values over comparable full assay ranges because they are based on nonlinear curve fitting. The fluorescence intensity directly corresponds to the concentration of the biomolecule present in the sample. Fluorescence assays can accurately detect very small quantities of the analyte. A fluorescence-based assay does not detect degraded material. Thermo Fisher Scientific also offers the NanoDrop-1 UV visible spectrophotometer to measure purified DNA, RNA, and protein. The NanoDrop instrument allows you to directly measure 1 to 2 microliters of sample with no dilution. The NanoDrop-1 instrument's accuracy, simplicity, and speed make it an excellent choice for the evaluation of purified DNA, RNA, and protein samples for use in many applications, such as qPCR, sequencing, microarrays, and antibody arrays. The NanoDrop-1 instrument determines the concentration of total nucleic acid by measuring absorbance at 260 nanometers. A 1 microliter sample is loaded directly onto the measurement pedestal. A liquid column is formed and the sample's absorbance is measured. The NanoDrop instrument provides an absorption spectrum for each sample. The absorption spectrum can provide information about sample purity or presence of contaminants. Like fluorescence, the amount of light absorbed at 260 nanometers corresponds to the amount of nucleic acid present. Unlike fluorescence, absorption measures the total amount of nucleic acid present including DNA, RNA, oligos, etc. Using fluorescence and absorption detection methods helps to dramatically increase the dynamic range of analyte detection. The absorption profile provided by the NanoDrop-1 instrument can be used to detect contaminants, which may impact downstream applications. For example, proteins absorb at 280 nanometers. Therefore, the absorption 260 over 280 ratio can be used to estimate nucleic acid sample purity. Protein and peptide concentrations can also be obtained by measuring absorbance at 205 nanometers. For example, phenol, which is used to extract nucleic acids. The qubit fluorometer uses distinct dyes to detect and quantify specific biomolecules, such as cholesterol, glucose, galactose, sucrose, etc. Every lab should have the best of both worlds. The Qubit and NanoDrop-1 instruments enable accurate, easy, and fast quantitation of biomolecules. The Qubit fluorometer offers specificity, whereas the NanoDrop-1 instrument offers information about the sample, such as purity ratios and the presence of contaminants.